Solar thermal technology. It is essentially using the sun's radiation to heat uh, water. And it's different than photovoltaic technology, which uses the sun's radiation and converts it to electricity. Solar thermal, or solar heating, is a much more uh, efficient use of the sun's radiation because we can capture more of it and turn it to heat much easier than uh, the photovoltaic process. Stagnation or, or overheating uh, is, a, is a very big problem um, because when systems are functioning normally, when you're using the hot water, then the system works exceptionally well. But when you stop, when, for example, you go on vacation, and your home is not using any hot water, systems can reach temperatures of 200 to 220 degrees Celsius. Uh, solutions for this are, are people climbing on their roofs and putting blankets over their solar systems uh, or over their solar panels to prevent this from happening. There's definitely been uh, a, a detriment to the overall commercialization of solar thermal um, due to overheating and stagnation. The ISC, or Integral Stagnation Control Technology, is passive, which means it uses no additional power. It does not affect the overall size of the solar thermal collector, and it requires very little maintenance. So what we've done is that we've just added another channel or gap behind the absorber, which allows ambient air or surrounding air to vent through the solar collector housing itself, and thereby removing the excess heat from the absorber and rejecting it to the surrounding environment. It uses a passive alloy element which reacts to temperature. When the interior of the solar collector reaches uh, the control point, it opens a damper assembly and then that allows air to vent through the collector. Uh, surprisingly simple technology, surprisingly difficult to, to implement in a reliable, uh, cost-effective way. The great thing about this technology is that it will not only save consumers money but will move us away from our reliance on fossil fuels and drive us towards a renewable energy future.